Sup guys, it's Ten Kosh and today we are doing the Blood Claw Adventure in AFK Arena. Uh, Waking Brutus is waiting for us. Let's go and see. After this, we will have the boss as well. Oh my god, no, it doesn't work again. We gotta switch to the goddamn home. So there it is, and now we are actually a character. We are not the card, and that's fantastic. We gotta talk to the Brutus, playing as an Esther this time. Let's claim the chest straight away while we can. And we gotta go to the left, to this village. Military camp. Let's go and take a look. We are going to scout. So, let's go scout. Nothing down here. We go up. Uh, so far, it should be more of a story-driven adventure, I think, than a combat one. Outer lighting, it will cause a disturbance. I'm not sure if we should do it. Actually, light up this desert altar. Bam. Something happened here. Uh, those guys are distracted, kinda, I think. Let's de deploy them. Distract. There we go. So there, over there, we don't have to fight them or something. We got the chest here. And we can go to the left. Those guys, are they distracted? No, they're not. Okay, they're still, uh, careful over there. Now we go here and talk to this quicksand claw post. Alright. From here, we go to the left and take another chest. And now we're gonna go north. In order to go north, we gotta talk to Scryth over here. Let's go. After the dialogue, we go back to the village over here and go to the post. Alright, sweet. And we go all the way to the north now, so we got access to that area. On the right, we have nothing, so there is no loot, right? Right. Gotta make sure that we won't lose anything. There are two uh, distractions, I think. And two camps on the left, so let's light this one at the bottom and this one at the top. That will distract the camps, hopefully. First one, let's go to the bottom one so we can claim the chest. Alright, they got going to investigate it and we are getting the loot. Then we are moving north. Alright. Here, do we have a chest here? I'm not entirely sure. Let's go here and see what's there. We gotta talk to Scryth over there. But before that, okay, this area is blocked so we can go there. We definitely gotta go to the right now. Avoiding all the camps if we, if we can. And we can. And yeah, we talk to Scryth now. We got some cutscene, kinda sort of cutscene over here. And we gotta do the fight here with those elite enemies. They are not that strong, so you should be able to beat them no problem. Let's take a look how the fight will go. Yeah, poor Brutus is going down. Rip. Rip. Alright, yeah, that won't be hard. That will be an easy fight right here. Although the Brutus is really getting use of his own vulnerability here. Alright, so what happened after this fight? That barrier is gone, so we can go more to the north. Actually, it's pretty straightforward. I don't think that you will need a guide for this. It's very easy to do. You get another chest here and another dialogue in this um, tent. Here, after the dialogue, Brutus accepts the Earth Emblem to become the Awakened Brutus. Now we're playing as a Brutus and here... We have some enemies to defeat, actually. And, like, there are a couple of those guys. Let's defeat those guys at the right. Any of them, that's a pretty easy fight as well. Uh, the interesting thing that we don't really have Awakened Brutus in our team, I think. And, like, we still use our main team. Doesn't matter what do we see on the screen. So I was curious about that. No relics, no nothing whatsoever. Uh, I'm just here for the chest, guys. Can you just give me the loot? No? Okay, let's take them out. Get in the chest now, and the bottom group as well. Easy, we are going in, claiming this chest, and probably... No, there are... Yeah, there is a second one on the left. So you take that. How many... We got a lot more loot pieces left. So, okay, uh, we don't need to take out this group right now, so we can go straight to the northern one to continue our adventure. When the enemy is defeated, going north, taking the chest, and taking out those two guys to go to the east. Done, and we got access to the chest on the right. I really like how you have the character here, and they are actually running instead of the card. It's it's new, and, and I like that. So now we gotta go to the left, so we defeat this guy. When this is done, another enemy, oh my god. And what do we see here on the left? Nothing. So we go north, we take one more chest on our way north. And here, uh, some more enemies to defeat, let's do that. Okay, get in the chest. 
and going north again. Like, this is a maze, like, in tower defense game. <laughs> so, I'm uh, glad that there are no tourists that are attacking me. What is this? Uh, Mauler will. Alright, alright, let's equip it. So, it is time for us to face our destiny. Let's go, the Corruptor. Oh my god, what? Let's go. Huge thing. Hopefully, we can't really defeat it, guys. Yeah, it's one shot and everyone rip. So, you can lose here, it's okay, but we got the Waking Brutals now. So, let's move on. Even as we lost the battle, let's actually figure out if the heroes that we lost. Yeah, they're still here. Another try to another enemy fight. And this time, we took them out in one shot. So easy, so easy, and unlock the boss challenge. Bam! You can fight the Dune Destroyer now. And before doing that, you might want to claim the crystal chest. So that way, are we done? No, we are not, because we forgot two chests, and they are... Come on. Yeah, we need two more chests, and they are in the very beginning, so we go back. I'm sorry, guys. I thought that they are not there, but they are there. So yeah, basically you go there, claim them, and then your adventure will be 100% completed. We're almost there. Bam, one. And uh, another enemy to take out. <laughs> and two, there we go. So now it's 100% completed, guys. Congratulations. Make sure to collect everything in the past. Otherwise, you'll have to replay this Voyage of Wonders. And now you go and fight the Dune Destroyer. For this guy, we will get a separate guide. So guys, let me know what do you think about New Watch Wonders. Do you like that moving characters? I like them quite a lot. Um, I did like the fact that there are no puzzles here and no complex fights, but overall it was a good journey, so it's not that bad. I like the story a lot, and I advise you guys to go through it, because it kind of uncovers how Brutus became the Awakened Brutus, so it's really interesting. And yeah, let me know what you think about all that in the comments down below while you're going there. Don't forget to like the video, share it with your friends, subscribe to this channel, hit the bell button so you won't miss anything, and check the pin command and the video description for additional links. We have the Discord link there that you might want, you will want to join, that that's a nice place to be, and more aid carrying and guides and videos. So yeah, you will find something useful there for sure. That's about it for now, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Stand Kosh out. Have a good one.